is round number three. Tyson runs from his stool, attacks Holmes. He's going to keep the pressure on him constantly. At 21 years old, he feels he can wear him down. And just Larry going three minutes for six, seven, eight, nine, ten rounds if it goes that far. He's going to run out of gas unless he's in better shape than most people believe he can get his body in. But he's got to start mounting some offense. Through the right hand that time, it hit Mike, but grazed him on the chin. Mike shakes his head no. Mike is showing no respect for Holmes' punching power. Plus, Larry is a guy in his career that won his fights with accumulation of punches. Come on. Although he had at one time a wonderful streak of knockout wins, Holmes still won most of his fights by accumulating punches before his knockouts occurred. This is the third round. All right, we got three. Let's go. Get his arms out. Get him out. Let's go. gets nailed by a crisp left hand as Tyson comes in. Come and again, Tyson is doing what he was able to do in the first two rounds, and that's just continue to win the round. We're halfway through this, the third round. Mike attacks. Larry has brilliant defense. Mike really hasn't been able to catch him much yet. Larry tries to do something inside, and Mike counters by throwing four or five punches. Mike almost has to reach up to get his 5'11 and a half. Larry is 6'3. Mike's head is right in the face of Holmes. Holmes knows brilliantly how to tie him up and how frustrating it is. Bring out the lead, bring out the lead. Let's go. Come on, Eddie. Larry with that left hand down, and he better not leave it down. He better keep it up in the face of this guy. Now Larry tries to work some uppercuts. This has been more of an aggressive round for Holmes, but not good enough to win the round. Twenty seconds to go in this the third round. Now Cortez says to Mike to keep your hands up. Oh, first good right hand landed. That was right at the bell. Okay, all right, okay. You're looking in the corner of Larry Holmes. You hear them talking to him. Watch this. This is the part right at the end of the round. He caught Larry flush that time. Larry able to shake it off and come back with a shot of his own. Now the bell sounds here, and that was a situation which if you hear some guys in the background yelling you're a dirty uh, fighter or whatever. Mike, uh, who's had trouble with a bloody nose in training, has been a lot trickling from his nose now. But that's not a question of dirty fighting. When you hear the bell and you're in the middle of a combination of punches, you don't stop. So nothing dirty about the fight so far. We're coming up to round number four. I believe Tyson has won all three of the first three rounds. This is round four. Let's see if Larry can pick up the offensive bit. Larry up on his toes now. This is the way a young Larry Holmes would have fought Mike Tyson. Now Holmes is going to maybe going to open up some offense here. The crowd loves to see this. Larry definitely a sentimental favorite. You see that head right in the face of Larry Holmes. Nothing said by Joe Cortez about that. Here's Tyson attacking again. Larry knows exactly how to take away that punching power in tight. Larry has a more confident look on his face now than he had in the first round. Left hook caught him that time, though. Can't get too cute with this guy. You've got to keep moving. All right, break, break out, break out, team, break out, team. Larry has all the rig savvy that a lot of the fighters that Mike Tyson has faced have not possessed. 
nice and boards in. No damage done here at all. He's got that face right in the chin and the cheek of Larry Holmes again. And again, Larry knows how to tie him up. When Larry was up on his toes and sticking and moving with that left hand, that's the way to fight Mike Tyson. But a 38-year-old Larry Holmes could not continue that round after round. Oh, a big right hand! And down goes the former champion. He was there, right in the button. The count is up to six, seven, and eight. Larry is hurt. I don't know if he's going to be able to survive this round. He's definitely hurt. His legs are gone. And in comes Mike. It was a big right hand. Larry's down again. Down he goes. I don't know if he'll be able to continue. It's up to four and five. His eyes are clear. It's up to seven and eight. He's going to be able to continue. Tyson knows he has him in trouble. It's just a matter of time. Larry will not survive this round. He's trying to fight back with everything he has. He's trying desperately. But this is not the same age man that was able to do it against Ronaldo Spikes. He goes with a big right hand. The left hook. Now he stays on his feet. Showing tremendous heart. Now with a left hook. Holmes is getting set up for the right hand. Here it comes, the left one come inside. There's the left, there's the right. Now he's ready to go again. He's hit with the left hand. 17 seconds. He may be able to get by the round now. He should be hanging on. Now with the right hand, the left hand. He's gonna hang on, or they'll stop the fight. Down he goes. Now he's hurt. It's all over. He is knocked out. He didn't even bother the call. It was a vicious, vicious right hand. It came like a bolt. He looked for it, 